Father, through the support of my government, these youths have so far organized themselves into 300 circles, and with our support, they have been able to mobilize Kenya Shilling's 1.4 billion in savings. I would like to urge Kenyans to, to draw a clear distinction between the positive impact of the NYS program and the deplorable mismanagement of the past orchestrated by individuals who were determined to railroad its success. Please have comfort that all those involved in pilfering resources earmarked for our youth will indeed be held to account. Fellow Kenyans, our fathers had a special attachment to the land of this nation. They knew that prosperity and freedom for their children depended on the land, and that is why they fought for it, and why they tended it with care, and that is why they charged us not to let even an inch of it be lost. Today we can be proud of our management of that inheritance. We can be proud of our support for farmers, our promotion of agriculture, and the deepening of our agricultural development since independence. Indeed, in just three years since 2013, we have distributed more than half a million tons of subsidized fertilizer to our farmers, cutting prices and improving produ productivity. Two more fertilizer blending plants have been established with an annual capacity of 300,000 tons. Of course, we remember that tea, coffee, sugar, and other crops matter deeply to Kenyans. 